Well, how is everybody doing today? It is a typical Sunday. We have this Ford in the shop. And we've got something that we're going to go ahead and add to it. Ever since we bought this truck, Charlotte was worried about it leaving her stranded on the side of the road. You've seen a couple videos ago that we ended up mounting a bike on the 9560. Well, now we have a bike for the Ford. Every Ford should have one. The truck comes with a spare tire. It should also come with a bike, right? So that if you break down, you can ride home. You haven't got to bother anybody. So this is a, I don't know how to pronounce it, Hacky, H-A-O-Q-I. We're gonna go ahead and get this out of the truck, assemble it, and then Charlotte is gonna run it around. We're gonna race, she's gonna race this Ford. So we always hear about all the jokes of these Ford trucks that, you know, they have hand warmers on the tailgate and they have you know, these various other options so that you can keep yourself warm while you're pushing on the tailgate. Well, this one's going to have a bike. Yeah. All right. So let's go ahead and get this out of the box, get it assembled and run it up and down the road a little bit here. You ready? Yeah. All righty. Well, we've got everything out of the box. This has, um, I guess I'm really not quite sure yet, but it came with two batteries. I don't know if we hooked both batteries up or not. Um, they really didn't tell me what model they were sending, but this is the Antelope uh, model. And I'm not really sure yet. We'll figure it out as we go here. They might have sent us, it might be a spare battery, but it's going to go right in here. We'll have to read up on that a little bit. Yeah, like we're going to read the owner's manual, right? <laughs> All we have to do is we have to take this clamp off here, put the handlebars on, take that stud out down below, and then just set the forks down over the tire. It appears that it came with a bicycle tire pump, which is kind of handy. Um, but other than that, got a headlight that we're gonna go ahead and get mounted. Um, this is a quick release uh, stud set for uh, the front wheel. 
and we'll have to put the fender on. So it looks like we got maybe 10 or 15 minutes worth of stuff to get installed here and then we will go ahead and run it up and down the road, right? It almost looks like a mini motorbike, you know? Fat tired unit. Um, I don't know, we've got, I think it takes both batteries. It looks like another battery hooks up here. We'll figure that out though. All right, so we have this all put together and we just have it setting up in the back of the truck and strapped down to give you a visualization on how it looks in the back of the truck here. We are gonna take it for a little bit of a ride here up and down the road. It's got two separate batteries on it. There's one that goes underneath the seat and then there's one on the main part of the uh, frame. It's got a working headlight up front and it's got a working brake light on the back. It kind of looks like a mini uh, motorcycle. It's got an adjustable uh, seat on it. It is set right now for uh, Charlotte. Once I get on it, we'll raise the seat up and we'll run it around. I think this is just a 20 inch uh, wheel on it and it has a seven speed Shamu uh, transmission with a Bufang uh, motor which is in uh, the wheel here. So that looks like a pretty good fit for the old Ford, huh? Do you feel a little more comfortable now that you know you've got some means of transportation once this thing breaks down? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to get this unloaded and we'll run it up the road. Well, Charlotte's going to run this up the road. We'll see what kind of speed we get out of it. And then when we get she gets back, I'll jump on it. That thing, I wonder if you could do wheelies on it. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe. So, well, I'll follow you up the road. Be careful. Okay. All right. Well, we'll just follow her up to the firehouse and back here and we'll see how this thing does. That bike is a little more her size. I don't know how fast it goes, but we're currently going 15 miles an hour uh, right now. The firehouse is only, that's not even a half a mile. Uh, up the road here. I should have measured the tires on that. I think those are 20 inch. And we're clipping along about 15 miles an hour. It looks like she's Got the pedal assist on, she's doing a little pedaling and and it's motoring along as well. And she's getting up to 18, 19 miles an hour there. Just gotta watch the traffic, make sure I don't have nothing that comes up in behind me here. This is kind of a dangerous thing that we're doing here but yeah she's gonna turn around at Curtis Road not go to the firehouse she's safe to do that I'll turn around at the firehouse now I gotta catch her <laughs> She waited for us here. We'll have her run on the opposite side of the road. So, go. Cool. <laughs> 
<laughs> go on the other side of the road. Yeah, go on the wrong side. We do everything wrong here. <laughs> That's why we could talk to her on the way down the road here. How fast does it say it's going? Truck says you're doing 20. She can't hear me. Yeah, we're doing like 20 miles an hour. So that's all motor right there. Well, I'm going to go and get in the driveway so that we're not causing a accident here. What'd you think? Crazy. Yeah? yeah. Cool. Got like gold rims on it, you know? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Well, I guess I'll take a turn on it. Well, and uh, see how it does here. I'm going to have to raise the seat up a little bit here, but we'll run it around here myself and see if it. Uh, passes the test with a larger person on it. It looks like a smaller person bike, but um, yeah. Oh no, what are we doing? Well, that didn't go as planned there, so I was trying to see if I could master doing a wheelie. And <laughs> Charlotte actually had her phone out. That's what she videoed that on. But man, my elbow hurts a little bit. <laughs> Charlotte's laughing like crazy. But, I can't. Um, it's not now okay. I guess it's my turn to actually ride it without doing any wheelies because I obviously <laughs> um, I'm not coordinated <laughs> enough to do uh, a wheelie here. So we'll go ahead and give this a try. I guess. What do you seem to think of it? Do you like it? I think it's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. Oh God. Jesus! Oh, well, <laughs> that's what happens, right? Bar oh my God! So, all right, let's see if we can. <laughs> oh my God! To adjust the seat up a little bit. You know, after you got off of it there, I figured I would try to do a couple of wheelies first, and I don't know. I guess we better not get the bike ramp out. Oh, probably not. No? <laughs> oh, boy. Let's see here. See if I can keep from running in anything here. Ah. Oh, Lord. Where is he going now? Oh, okay, never mind. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh! <laughs> wow! <laughs> Get a power slide. <laughs> yeah, this seems to be pretty good. Got our little goofy horn on there. 
So, we better go in and see if your mother's got Easter dinner ready, right? Oh, probably. Yeah. Well, I guess that's going to do it for this one, folks. So, some of this stuff you don't want to try at home. But, <laughs> <laughs> that's how this arm is. How's that guy? A little baby bruise on there? Oh, maybe? just a little bit. Yeah. I got my Sunday clothes on, too, and I'm all dirty. Oh, jeez. 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 Oh, well. Well, there'll be a link in the description, guys. You can go ahead and click on that to find out the particulars. So, we better get into dinner. Probably shouldn't know how to tell your mother about that one. Huh? She'll see on YouTube. <laughs> She'll be watching it and be like, Oh boy. I, oh god. Well, alrighty. Take it easy, folks. I'll catch you at the next one.